Are you ready to get your face in the best shape ever in 2020? Stay with me and lift with me. We're gonna work our faces now. All right, welcome back. I am Christine Beyer, licensed esthetician for 20 years, and everybody wants to get their body in shape for the new year. And in my experience, they wanna get their face in shape as well. So what are you gonna need? I know you have some devices at home. Dig them out and let's get started. <laughs> what you're gonna need is an LED. You may have my brand, you may have the light stem, you could have some cheap Chinese junk. I don't care, get it out, let's work with it. Also, we're gonna be doing a little bit of microcurrent, but we're gonna switch it up because we're gonna be doing two things at once, right? I want you to really maximize your facial workout time. All right, so I'll be using the Clair Blend Mini, which is a facial toner that is very pleasant. You don't feel it. But if you've got anything, new face, face master, zip, whatever you got at home, grab it and work with me. What else will you need? You're gonna need some conductive gel. I've got some going here. This is one of my favorites. I got so many questions about what should I use for conductive gel that I just went ahead and made one. <laughs> so this is very nice. It's got aloe and azaline. Azaline is a blue flowering plant that is known for its soothing properties. And this has a heck of a lot of minerals in it to help you lift. Don't have a conductive gel, grab some mineral water, no excuses, and let's go. So you'll also need a headband or just Put your hair back in a towel, girl. Let's go. It was funny, this idea came to me. I was doing Leslie Samsoni's walk at home and I adore her. She is just like such a breath of fresh air. She's a sweetheart. I, I think I joined for the year, her group. And oh, by the way, I have a group that you can join too for more videos like this. If you, if you love this video, we'll, we'll be doing a lot more work with me. Lift with me facial workouts. So. All right, we're assuming your face is clean and we're just gonna put on this conductive gel. Now, if you don't have a fan brush, this would be nice to invest in because it just makes it simple. There's also something very easy to do is just get a little spray bottle, put some mineral water in it, and when your conductive gel of choice starts to dry down, this one doesn't tend to dry down very quickly, which is why I love it. But when that starts to dry down, with these modalities, especially microcurrent, you just have to be super saturated for best results. So let's keep our faces nice and wet for optimum results. And let's go, let's time it, let's do 10 minutes. Okay, Google, set timer for 10 minutes. Sure, 10 minutes, and that's starting now. Let's go. We're gonna do one side, LED, other side, microcurrent. And here we go, this is 10 seconds. So I wanted to make this really exciting and be bouncing all around the room. I'm gonna put some, some techno music to it, some house or something. But, you know, you can't really jump all around <laughs> when we're doing this and make it super exciting. I'm just gonna do some basic moves that I love to bring up this side of the face. This is on a 10 minute timer. So we're just going nice and slow lifting those cheeks and if you have problem areas like if you've got a nasal labial fold you know this is big I've got videos on that you would want to release that before you start this oops I'm going too fast come on I'm gonna go up underneath scoop up underneath that cheek this is also a fascia release move so we're gonna release that fascia because if the fascia is not released, it's gonna pull that cheek down. So just doing this move, it feels good. Kind of applying some pressure to break up that deep fascia that likes to hold that cheek down. And then we're gonna go straight up. Okay, Google, how much time is left? T minus seven minutes and 40 seconds. Ooh, not bad. All right. So we can go up here. Okay. 
I'm gonna do five minutes each side, which generally isn't a lot. It's not a lot of time. However, it's better than nothing. And I did just did Leslie Samsioni's. It's called her program's called Walk at Home. And it's so cute. I love it because she interacts with everybody. And I'm like, that's so great because she's in a gym with a bunch of people. So I'm like, gosh, I should do something like that. But I can't invite you all to my studio. <laughs> so, and she divided her session into a quick warm up. I think it was about 15 minutes of high intensity walking, versions of walking. That's what she does. And then we did a quick cool down and she let us stretch out by ourselves. So what I'm gonna do is five minutes each side. We need to do the neck, we gotta get down there. All right, let's get down to the neck. I didn't put anything on the neck. And once again, if you have trouble areas, you'll wanna go in. There are some ways to combine lifting and releasing moves at once, and I will show you those, show you those during the, these little mini snippets, lift with me snippets. But I have a lot of really targeted videos up on YouTube on how to release different areas. And when you release before you lift, you get a better lift. So on my neck, I tend to only go sideways. But if you have a long, thin neck with neck banding or like little <clears throat> rings across your neck from sleeping, what you'll want to do is go up and really get dig into those rings because they're little fascia fault lines that you'll want to release. Now, they get reactivated when you sleep, which sucks, but they can be significantly softened. So do not fear. All right, so we're moving on. Let's ask Siri how much time we got left. Or Google. <laughs> hey Google, how much time is left? You've got five minutes and three seconds remaining. Okay, we're gonna switch sides. All right, I have a bunch of this. I that over. This one's only available for Google Play <laughs> Music subscribers. Okay, Google, cancel. <laughs> Google's getting carried away. I had a little extra. I'm just gonna, whoop, ow. <laughs> so, now, you would wanna follow the instructions of your microcurrent machine, but you know, some, some moves are pretty universal. And the lift and hold is universal. I love the lift and hold. I just did a video on lifting and holding and talked about the importance of that. Let's dig up underneath that deep fascia underneath the cheek. Dig it up, dig it up. And like I said, this is on a 10 second timer. This way. And in my group, I have a lot of really detailed videos on how to work an area. In addition to the content that I have on YouTube, I have so much content. I mean, when you've been doing facial contouring massage and facials for 20 years, you accumulate a lot of knowledge about what it takes to lift a face and make a face look better. So, be sure to check out some of my other videos. And I'm sort of just motoring through this. I go on automatic, automatic pilot and the Claire Blend people get really upset with me because you really need to hold it for the 10 seconds. Okay, so let's do it. You're doing a eye move. Now some microcurrent machines, it's a little tough to get into these smaller areas with like the new face I know those big balls don't really allow you to get in around the eye and that's why I prefer this guy that and it has randomized frequencies too so you just don't really have to think about switching anything or changing anything and what randomized frequencies mean is that it is it is hitting the skin at all these different levels. It's different penetration levels every second. 
So we don't even have to think about it. It's just doing it. And that's why I like this device. It's just really simple. Oh, and I'm going too fast again. Oh my. Okay, Google, how much time is left? There's two minutes and eight seconds to go. All right, so we got two minutes. I actually, I think I did the left eye, but not the right. Something important about doing microcurrent on the eyes is that if you have a very hooded or heavy upper lid, I would work only the forehead first for at least a week or two to get this frontalis, this muscle, to get that lifted first, and then attempt to go in and do any upper lid work. Otherwise, you'll just get puffy and you'll be unhappy with your results. I'm going back to the same side. I'm gonna do the neck, so I only have a little bit of time left. And I'm going too fast again. <laughs> oh well, let me tell you what, a little bit of current on the face, uh, faster than normal is better than no current on the face, because microcurrent is so special. It's adds energy to the skin, it tones those muscle fibers, unlike any other modality. So it's really, it's really a special, special modality. And it's done nothing but grow in popularity since I started really specializing in microcurrent back in 2003. So, okay Google, how much time is left? You've got 32 seconds to go. So I got 30 seconds, let's just, Concentrate on the side lift. So thanks for lifting your face with me today. I expect more of these in the future where I can talk a little, little tidbits and problem areas you may have and how to solve that. And if you want more in-depth information, just join my group. It's Christine. There it is. We're done. Okay, Google, stop. Just join my group. It's ChristineBuyerBeauty.com. And thanks for watching.